Welcome again to Board Fam, and today I'm bringing to you the Playbook BlackBerry Playbook software update version 2.1.0.1032. Over any other previous versions, I'm not sure what the numbers uh, correspond to, but at least the one little tidbit I know is that the last update, which is 0 0.6. 88 um, sucked the battery life and so so far from the blogs and everybody else's reviews um, the battery is definitely an improvement on this new update um, it brings a couple of cool features and I've tested a few out some have had luck with some I haven't um, to the actual update itself took about half an hour to download and install um, and it, I mean, it came over automatically um, by the time I got home and took a look at the playbook. Um, the, I actually took a look and one of the key features I was looking for, I didn't see any change. So of course I went over to the BlackBerry and looked at um, App World and looked at the Bridge application and it indeed had an update. So I installed the update to the Bridge and once each restarted you could actually um, you know, see some changes. Um, the first I would say the, uh, the, one, the one I was interested in the most is actually the text messaging. So you are going to be able to send text messages, send and receive from the playbook. So I have a spare phone number on the side, of course, to test it out. And when you go into the bridge application, you can actually see that there's the text message icon. There we go. So let's grab our little test phone. Let's find uh, some random hello, hello test and hit send and I'm not going to look at the BlackBerry handheld that is and in a second you should have ah, vibrating so we have a text message and on the playbook you now have the indicator on the upper left hand corner so if we click on those uh, we don't want the messages but let's click on the the text so you have the text icon instead so if we click on that it opens up. Uh, I must say that well, one person mentioned that um, they had a couple of recipient errors so if they sent to person A it showed up under person B. I haven't seen that at all yet um, but when I did open up the text bridge you could it was a, it was just slightly slow in responding so first you would actually see the, the telephone numbers and then it caught up with itself and showed the names um, and had your contact information had the photo attached. So if we take a look I have um, here we go little test text message and if I reply here we go test and it came through on my test device there we go we don't need that phone at the moment but if you actually take a look at the phone the actual Blackberry you'll see the same text message thread. So we had the hello and just a couple of seconds ago I sent the reply back test and test. So it, it seems to be working great. A couple of the other features um, are related to email and calendar and if you know like a lot of devices um, when you have the the landscape mode that you're holding the tablet when you're flipping it around it doesn't adjust. Um, some applications it will and some it won't but that's one update to the playbook is that you can actually use the landscape but also portrait mode for email here we go let's go back to the email thread so you have the portrait mode but also mm -hmm, let's go the other way calendar and also contacts so you can view it portrait in addition to landscape um, that's a peeve of mine because I really it kind of bugs me when I'm you know trying to you know go back and forth between applications of course multitasking and I have to keep flipping it around so that does come in handy um, related to to you know, your organizer and files um, the other update was that you're supposed to be able to transfer files over Bluetooth and the Wi-Fi connection through the bridge um, so far, I haven't seen anything really as far as any menu changes. So I, you know, went into the file transfer and made sure that was on. On the BlackBerry itself, I actually made sure that the file transfer was enabled also. And I haven't been able to send any files. So there are no changes to the menu options on the playbook itself. And then when I go to the BlackBerry and say I pick a picture, 
and I go to hit send over Bluetooth, it'll see the playbook as one of the options for devices, but as soon as you hit send, it says, you know, fail to find service. So if anyone out there knows any updates or what I may be missing here on how to transfer, I've messed with a little, little bit and I haven't been able to send any files. So any feedback would be definitely welcome. And really the other update would be Android applications and not to flip around devices. I did actually have another playbook that I had sideloaded Android applications. So I did the update on this one also, and I haven't seen any real improvements so far. It says um, something about the Android player being improved, um, but when I tried to use Skype, for example, I still was not able to log in. So I'm, you know, if, I'm not sure if that's still, you know, going to be further down the line and we, I shouldn't hold my breath, or is it something else down the path of Android developer mode um, that I haven't, that is beyond my scope at the moment. So any updates anyone has, I, it's definitely welcome and this is board fam signing off on the playbook software update enjoy people bye